Welcome everyone. In this video, we are going to set up a bootable USB flash drive with the Fedora 39 installation files on it. And after that, we are going to go through the process of setting up the BIOS on the uh, target system so that it boots from the, the uh, USB flash drive. So let's go ahead and get started. First thing we need is the utility that we'll use to burn the ISO to the, the drive. That will be Fedora Media Writer, and we'll use the Windows version. And that is done. And also, we'll also need the Fedora 39 ISO. We have workstation available here. I use server. I've already pre-downloaded it because it takes, it's like two and a half gigs. It takes a while to download. But if you go to fedoraprojects.org, you'll also be able to find the, the server version of, of Fedora if, if you want that. All right, so next step, let's go into the download folder and let's install the Fedora Media Writer. Yes, I agree. Install. And next, and finish, and it'll start automatically. All right, there we go. So before we continue on, make sure you have the USB flash drive that you're going to use plugged into the device that you're running this utility on. And we'll hit select ISO file. Next, there's my drive, 4.1 gig flash drive. Uh, the minimum is two gigs from what I've read. So if you wanna use one that size, that's fine. Let's hit select and select our, our ISO, open and write. So this will take a little bit of time to install once we see some some activity, then we'll pause and I'll come back when it's complete. Um, in the meantime, please like my videos um, and subscribe to my channel. Hopefully what we're doing here is useful. It might not always be exciting, but it's always something that pops up. We're, we're always presenting something that pops up one or once or twice down the line if you do this stuff long enough. So there's some activity. And I am going to pause and I'll return when it's complete. And we are finished. So we'll go ahead and click finish. And we have one more option that appeared after we completed this, uh, this uh, burning the ISO to the flash drive. It's restore, restore, restore your flash drive. So if you ever want to use this for anything else, this utility also reverts the, the flash drive to its uh, original configuration. So just a note. And let's see, I think we're done here. So we can close this and our next step is to set up the BIOS to boot off of the, the USB drive and uh, prepare for the installation. Okay, so this is the display that's connected to the system that we're going to install Fedora on. So the next step is to take the, the flash drive that we just burned the ISO to and plug it into our, our target system here. And then from there, we will reboot the, the system. And when it starts to come up, we'll hit F2 to get into the BIOS. All right, there we are. And we need to adjust the boot priority. So this is my flash drive down here. We're going to move that up to the top. And this is an ASUS motherboard, the BIOS. This is what that BIOS looks like. I'm sure it looks different for other, other brands of motherboards, but 
they all have this area here somewhere that, that allows you to adjust the boot priority. So anyway, my flash drive is here. So when we reboot, it will boot from that device first. So let's do a save and exit and then hit OK. And the system will reboot off of that, that USB drive. We'll give it a minute here to let it let it read everything and there we go. There's our initial installation screen. So we're gonna arrow up to Fedora 39 install. Enter. And this will take a minute or so here, a little less. And should be almost done loading. And here we go. This is our initial setup screen. Hit continue. And from here, we'll format the drive, partition the hard drive, create user accounts, set the root password, and whatever else needs to be done. So that's pretty much it. I uh, hope this is helpful and, and uh, hope you enjoy it, hope you like it. Please like my videos, subscribe to my channel. I hope to do some other, other more exciting things over the, the course of the year, or, or at least helpful to, to people and with whatever they're trying to do, whatever you're, you all are trying to do. And I think uh, that's it. So thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.